people welcome back to my youtube channel Elliot Wave Principal I'm your host Shaheen I have already given a forecast of uh, gold and silver in today's video it's gonna be a bit different we are going to discuss the next trading setup um, giving a forecast is one thing but in today's video I'm going to um, provide a, an exact trading setup where we can actually trade um, the next larger swing so I'm bearish on gold and silver uh, and uh, I'll give some some of more technical analysis, maybe a point or two that I have missed on my previous analysis. So uh, let's have a look at those points first of all. So we need to go to daily time frame, and I'm saying uh, auto here, okay. So a couple of points, uh, actually one major point. First of all, we can see that this area is very important. We have uh, three important tops. Alright, and this top is also important. We have seen a top closer to it on a weekly time frame. So we are talking about important top right here. Let's uh it's gonna here it is. So this top is an important one. Okay, actually this one is these one are past. So these are new tops beyond the previous top and quite a bit of difference. But these three tops are very important, they're very close to each other. Uh, in terms of time as well and we can also use them in our present analysis so let's go on daily time frame and we can clearly see that this area got rejected the prices got into that area so the prices got into that area this one right over here and it got clearly rejected and came down now the important point here is not only it came down it kind of retesting that area right now again so this is a very very important signal and a lot of people are going to go bears uh, especially those retested kind of uh, trading setups so a lot of trading setups that are based on retesting a support area are going to go bearish so that's an important point if you are even bullish on gold you might wanna uh, wait for the bearish uh, the price again to bounce beyond the previous top this one which is this one right now we can see the price went beyond that point got rejected came through it very easily went quite a bit of deep it did not actually stay in there went deep in there and then kind of jumped up and retested that area so all we want to do is we if you are even bullish and if you see a bearish day uh, let's say the next trading day is bearish we have Christmas here um, Christmas is being celebrated throughout the world so if you see at uh, the next trading day the bearish day that will definitely be an indicator that not only that we have found a support but the trend has already started as well uh, the, and uh, we bring our trading setup here as well the next trading setup is in term wise in terms of price we have two important support areas uh, target areas there is a possibility that we can actually uh, go and retest this area and this is an important point area 1940-ish area this kind of falls somewhere in the middle of this area and this area so I'm expecting that prices these two areas are very close by so somewhere around the lower end of the day this area is very important also this the next target is this one right over here which is around 1810 to 1840 ish area and I'm thinking if price is uh, really strong enough or the trend is really strong enough we can I easily penetrate this area and go to 1840 ish area this is the next swing I'm talking about I'm not talking about the uh, next month or so I'm talking about the next thing happening in 10 trading days so our this trading setup we have two potential price targets first one is 1840 1940 and the second one is 1840 so about a and this is expected to happen in next 10 trading days once I go bearish I am bearish I have a position open already I'm enter gonna enter in the position and I now have two uh, sets of element um, um, for trading I have the time duration which is 10 days and I have price duration which is either 1940 ish or 1840 ish area for price targets so this is a new kind of uh, a lot of uh, I spent a lot of time on this particular individual trading setup uh, it's as easy once you enter into the trading setup and you f realize that okay the trend has turned bearish then it's expected to stay bearish for 10 days before uh, jumping considerably all right before we see a, a considerable correction and so there's a possibility in terms of price we can see 1940-ish area and if the bears are really controlled we can actually see 1840-ish area I hope that I was of some assistance in my previous analysis I did provide an Elliott wave analysis of the labeling 
but in terms of the the generic traditional technical analysis as soon as the price got rejected beyond that and then it goes retesting it and we can see the already the daily candlestick as well also indicating that we have seen a bearish uh, hint already so it's quite it's quite possible that because of this behavior the next uh, day on the downside could be quite a bit of a bearish action all right so we'll uh, keep an eye on the thing but this trading setup if you want to join me in uh, we can trade it together uh, and we'll keep an eye and once this goes successful I'll do more of it so one single trade is expected to last 10 trading days is going to cover somewhere around $100 uh, to $200 in terms of price reduction in gold wish you good luck with your trading have a good one and bye bye